Which of the following correctly lists the atoms in order of increasing atomic radius? Atomic radius refers to how large an atom's electron cloud is, which is determined by how far away the valence electrons are from the nucleus of that atom. And it increases as you go down and to the left on the periodic table. To answer this question, we need to talk about why that trend is the way it is. By using electron configuration, you can see that the atom's valence electrons occupy a higher energy level as you go down the periodic table. For example, the atoms in this row have valence electrons in the fourth energy level. As you increase the energy level, you're getting further away from the nucleus of that atom. So that's why the radius increases as we go down the periodic table, but now let's look at why it decreases as we go to the right. Within each row on the periodic table, all of the atoms have valence electrons that are in the same energy level. So atoms in the fourth row have their valence electrons in the fourth energy level. And as you go across the row, you're increasing the number of protons. And as the number of protons in the nucleus of an atom increases, it has a stronger pull on the valence electrons, which brings them closer to the nucleus of the atom and decreases the atomic radius. Now let's apply those principles to these four atoms. Notice that these are ions, which has a huge effect on their atomic radius because strontium normally would end with 5s2, but since it's strontium 2 plus, those two 5s electrons are gone and its electron configuration ends in 4p6. A similar thing happens with rubidium because normally it ends with 5s1 but that electron is gone because it has a plus one charge so it's also 4p6. Krypton is always 4p6 and bromine is usually 4p5 but it has a negative charge so it's also ending with 4p6. So since all of these are 4p6 and have their valence electrons in the fourth energy level all we need to think about is the number of protons in each nucleus. As the number of protons decreases, then the radius should increase, meaning bromine should be the largest, followed by krypton, then rubidium, and strontium is the smallest, which is shown by option B. Let me know in the comments if there are other topics you'd like to see covered.